Hello there. On this deal from the Andrew Robson Bridge online duplicate on BBO, East West have 12 spades, North South have 12 hearts. Wow. Hope you've been enjoying playing in our BBO duplicates. Supervised practice on Real Bridge. My daily instructional bridge casts. There's lots on offer for you. Check out the links on the screen. But let's get straight into this deal. East to start both sides of Val. Now East has to decide whether to open one spade or two spades, week two bid. East's hand does satisfy the rule of 20. That's normally the delineation, so I'd probably open one spade. Nothing for South to say at this juncture. And now West is thrilled, partners open one spade and a little surprised. And as you know, I'm a sucker for splinter bids. So West going four hearts, hoping partner remembers this is always the dangerous splinter. Well, North's about to say something, but if North had just passed looking bored, East would have serious concern that partner had forgotten the splinter bid, or maybe that East had forgotten their understanding, because with a void heart, it's quite likely that partner's got a lot of hearts and not also short in hearts. But anyway, North's not going to pass looking bored. In fact, North is choosing between a double and a five heart bid. I don't think double achieves a whole lot here. So North's going to go five hearts. And now East, with knowing the opponents have 12 hearts. Five spades, clearly. So now South is also surprised with the way the bidding is going with six cards in partner's hearts. So if you had that south hand, you would probably guess the opponents can make six spades. You haven't got a lot of defence there. Queen of spades falling in one round. You'd probably guess that your side is making about nine tricks in hearts. It may actually be ten tricks, as we'll see, but you would guess nine tricks. So you would think that as long as the opponents are in game, you're best just keeping quiet. But if the opponents get to a slam, maybe you sacrifice. So here, pass. Now West has to guess, but it does feel to me reasonable to guess six spades with six cards in spades. Some lovely cards there in the hand. Ace of diamonds, king of clubs. Pass, pass. And now... South does expect East West to make six spades, so that would mean they would win 1,430 points, which means that seven hearts doubled can go five down and North-South are getting a better result than conceding 1,430. So although it is guessy, I think probably South can guess to bid seven hearts. If West passed here... That would be inviting seven spades, so therefore showing first round heart control, presumably a void. So here West doubles to say, partner, I don't think we should go seven spades. And East is certainly happy to respect that decision. So this is actually the par contract, seven hearts doubled. Six spades would make losing only the ace of clubs. If South leads a club, then Declara plays a low club from the West dummy hand. North has to win the ace. If South doesn't lead a club, then Declara can play out the diamonds and chuck two clubs away on the two long diamonds in hand. So six spades would make 1,430 points to East-West. Seven hearts doubled is bound to be cheaper. Let's see how much cheaper it is. East is leading. King of Diamonds looks the right lead. King from King Queen wins the trick. And although it doesn't actually matter what East does next, I think in practice East might try the King of Spades in case Declare is out of Diamonds and has one spade in their hand. West overtaking again doesn't matter. Declare a roughing. And now Declare is going to draw Trump. Note singular. And now what Declare is going to do is concede a diamond 
This is to improve their end play chances in clubs. Eliminating the diamonds. West doing it for De Clara. OK, so it's time to tackle clubs now. Ace first. And now upper club. Now the reason why we've gone out of our way to eliminate diamonds is if East plays low, uh, we have a guess. And let's say we miss guess by playing the Queen and West wins the King and doesn't have the Jack. West is end played to give a rough and a discard. We can rough in our north hand and chuck away the ten of clubs in the south hand. So similarly, if East plays low and we miss guess and play the 10 and we lose to West's doubleton jack and West doesn't have the king. Again, West is end played. But it doesn't come to anything because East plays the jack and now queen and king and it's all over. Seven hearts doubled is three down. Not sure how that would score. Probably reasonably well for East-West, actually, because it's not clear that Slam will be bid by East-West at that many tables. So seven hearts double, three down, 800 points is better for East-West than making their spade game. But lots of interest and excitement for all four players to 12 card fits. Hope you enjoyed thinking through each player's decisions and look forward to seeing you again very soon. Bye!